What is going on everybody? This is Striker welcoming you to a vlog. Now I haven't done a vlog in a little bit and uh, I figured now was a great time to do it. So yesterday, I don't know if you can tell, but my bush head is now not a bush head anymore, which is fantastic. Went ahead and got my hair cut. Uh, so let, let's go ahead and talk about it. So first off, I went to Sport Clips for the first time ever. I, I had never been to and didn't even know that there was one here in town until a couple of weeks ago. Meant to go the past couple of weekends, but never got around to it. So I decided after Tuesday at work, I was like, forget about it. I'm going because I was tired of waking up with bedhead and like literally it was like all over the place. It was an absolute mess in the morning. So check it out. Check it out. Bam. Bam. Got the little fade doohickey going on. So anyways. I went there for my first time, didn't know what to do, stood there kind of awkwardly, and they were like, oh, just sign in on the little kiosk thing, there's like a little, like, screen with like a tiny little keyboard underneath it. So I made an account and everything, and I got the free MVP experience for my first time being there, so I got charged for a haircut, but I got everything else that went with it. So she went ahead and talked about, like, what, what we're gonna do about my hair and everything, cut my hair, and then we went over to, like, the little, uh, the chairs, like, with the sinks on it. So I sat in that, and then she presses this little button that makes the chair like vibrate like to massage your back and stuff. Uh, washed my hair, put on a, a hot steamy towel on my face, gave me a, like a little tiny like head massage and face massage when doing both. Then we went back over to the chair, she put some like leave-in conditioner into my hair to soften it up and to catch any of the loose stuff that might have still been up in there, you know, the little tiny prickly hairs. And then she used this little like, like gun thing, it looks almost kind of like a, like a, a hand drill. Uh, but it, it had a power cord, it wasn't like one of those cordless ones. But on the end, it's got almost like this rounded little... It's, it's like a flattened ball, almost, and I don't know really how to describe it. It was, it was like this, like this on the end, sort of, but like, like not as, not as round-ish, like that. And when you press the button, it vibrates, and then it, it was the shoulder massage up there, and then right along, like, my shoulder blades down my back and everything. So it was a great experience! Got my hair cut, it's looking a lot better, and actually for the first time ever I have this whole like super part thing where like she shaved in a little bit, uh, which I've always had the hard part there anyways in my hair, so it's just, it, it's a little bit different. And yeah, I've never had my, my hair with, with the fade on it, uh, usually I just would have it straight sides. I mean, you guys have been around for several years and I've had pretty much the same hairstyle. So after I cut all of that off to celebrate getting a thousand subscribers, I pretty much just let my hair grow out. Uh, I think I cut it off it back in November, somewhere around there, November-ish. And then I cut it again in December, cut it to one inch in length both times, and then just let it keep going. And oh my goodness, for the first time in months, I was sitting in my car going to work and I was like, huh, my head's cold. Because I lost all of the insulation on my head. It's a little bit ridiculous, it's a gigantic change. I mean, the top is pretty much the same. Obviously, you can tell I got I got my, my product all up in here. All of my product up in here, but then back here is just natural foofy. Uh, but my hair has been pretty well trained, so I didn't have to do anything to actually get it to do this. Just put some product in the front to keep it from falling forward, and we're good to go. So let me know in the comment section below what you guys think, if you think it's I, if you think it's trash, or whatever. And if you've ever been to a great haircutting place, I'd say that was probably the best experience I've ever had. Just I actually came away feeling like my haircut was a decent haircut. I, I would go to Great Clips or Super Clips, not to throw the entire chain under the bus. It always depends on the person who cuts your hair. But I would leave going, wow, my hair looks ugly as hell. And I'd have to wait a couple months for it to grow out to then get it recut and fixed. So anyways, tell me about your favorite experience, whether that's at a barber shop or at a chain or anything like that. Let me know, like I said, what you guys think about it. That's all I got. It's a little bit of a shorter vlog, and I am going to upload a second video today, which is probably going to be even shorter, which is just a little tiny quick update on the channel and what we're doing uh, the next couple of weeks-ish. So be on the lookout for that. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great day, everybody, and I will see you all next time.